Magnum bottle. A hundred ton hammer. I like these a lot. I'm going to buy the giant Hitachi, don't worry. I'm just looking. <laughs> oh god! That's 500 grand, what? Well, this counts as a baseball bat, so, um... Oh, but... Wait. Okay, yeah. I can't believe I just did that. What do you got for you? That's what you already have. Dandy umbrella would be... Long shoehorn. You know what? Fuck it. Let's give the cop a long shoehorn. <laughs> Good advertising. I could totally tell what these costumes are going to be. Also, wonderful resolution and uh, textures on those costumes up there. Why do they sell iron pipe? Um, that's a really good question, and it's one that I'm not entirely sure I can answer. <laughs> okay, just to make sure. So I could have been... Okay. So it's just a straight upgrade. Okay. Alright, fuckers. Who wants to get hitachi Don't answer that question. Well, that's ridiculous looking. Oh, I don't like those city slickers. That? Oh my god, that shoehorn! He slipped on his own lube. That's not a sentence I wanted to hear in this RPG. That was a that was two hit. Okay. Oh man. I remember this game. <laughs> I'm very thankful to be able to stream again. Not having this game around made the days worse. Okay, cool. I imagine the sex shop is only... only open at night. As unrealistic as that is. Why the fuck are you all the way back there? Um... Pigeon! Yeah, 
Don't get caught. Get serious. Check this out. I missed it, but it still did almost 200 fucking damage. Ow! You know what? Ow! How dare you! Um, the Sujimon League. Also, my gigantic Hitachi sure did paralyze that cop. This game's so silly. It's wonderful. I haven't been playing almost anything for the last, like, week and a half. Oh, that was smooth animation. Paralyzed with pleasure. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised Hitachi doesn't give brainwash. It totally would in Persona. <laughs> Oh, it should. Yeah. Dude, fucking Persona Scramble or Persona Strikers or whatever the fuck the English name is comes out next month, and I'm hype as fuck. That's going up. But that would be the third uh, Muso game that I bought that I haven't finished yet. Uh, Batbreaker. You're mad? Oh no, is it not coming out where you are? I don't want to break my bat. It's a 10,000 yen massager. Hmm? Ooh, 500 yen. Hmm? Ooh, 10 yen. Hmm? It's coming out on the Switch, right? And it's a sequel to Persona 5? Yes. To both of those questions. For stiff shoulders, clearly. I mean, that is the intended use, but... It, uh, initially, I guess. But Persona 5 is not available, so you don't know what happens. Yeah, that's very dumb. I believe that they want Persona 5 on the Switch, but... They're having trouble with it. It was the last thing I heard. There's only one of you. You're probably tough. Ow! The fuck are you... Giant purple sparkler? Yeah. Oh, and I'm not gonna buy it for that reason. I'll either wait for P5 to be available or when you get a PS5. Yeah. That sucks. Like, Persona 5 and especially Royal are very good games. Let's take a look. Um, Batbreaker. Heavily damage an enemy with a powerful swing of your bat. I think it's just... Like, the middle of this. Um... Hey, 
Hey, guy. Um, Persona 5 Royal is um, kind of like back in the day, if you played like Baldur's Gate 2 and then there was an expansion pack, that's kind of what Royal is. There's a fucking ton of new stuff in that game. Like, a lot of new story beats, new characters, new costumes, new enemies, new personas, new quests, new areas, just, uh... It's just a nice old time as well. Well, nice old time until the end, and then it gets real. Yeah. Like, I don't think it counts because it's the only fucking big game I finished last year other than Tokyo Mirage Sessions. But... I do want to say it's, like, my game of the year last year, even though... It probably shouldn't be because I didn't finish Final Fantasy VII. And I didn't finish, uh... Ghost of Tsushima. And I didn't play Ori, Will of the Wisps, and I haven't played Hades yet, so... I love Tokyo Mirage Sessions. The battle system in that game is fucking awesome. Arigato. You are an expensive salesman. Also, the music in Tokyo Mirage Sessions are... It, it's so fucking good. I'm mad it's not on Spotify. <laughs> How long have you had Hades and not played it yet? I mean, I bought it when it launched on Switch. I just haven't... Let's try the Batbreaker. Oh, Jesus! Okay. It was only 65 hours long. You don't like Hades? That's... I don't think anyone here is going to get mad at you over a gaming opinion. Yeah. The cops are tough. Or I guess the Sujimon cop. Don't like Hollow Knight? Um, I could totally see the Hollow Knight one. Ooh, I see you. Give me that. I haven't played Hades, so I can't really talk that much on that one. But... I can totally see the Hollow Knight one. Bug! Okay, Arachnid. Now you caught a bug the last time I played. Where exactly am I... Okay. The thing with, um... I think I would dislike Hollow Knight a little bit more, or I think I would like Hollow Knight a little bit less if I didn't have, like, somebody in chat being like, okay, th like, this is something you should probably be looking into, or whatever. It's a very directionless game, and I understand that's the point, but it's also, like, I can only Axiom Verge myself so many times before I lose my fucking mind doesn't click with you. Yeah, there's plenty of games like that. Like, I love Majora's Mask, but I'm not a particularly big fan of playing it. This hey, I beat that there? fucker! Yep. I beat him, and he died, and I felt fucking good! It's just you. 
Yeah, such great customer service, huh? No wonder this place is always empty. This place? I only run it for fun. Kind of prefer it empty, in fact. <laughs> Bullshit. Is that David Hayter? Hey there, Dachi san. Hey, Hiroha chan. Who are your friends? Some guests of mine. Kasuga and Namba. Hey. I added two more, by the way. You never bring anyone with you. In fact, is this a first? Uh, <laughs> I guess it is, now that you mention it. That must mean you actually like them, huh? <laughs> Hell no. You wouldn't catch me hanging with these knuckleheads unless I had to. <laughs> yeah, I get like that so you're often. You're so cute when you're embarrassed. Uh, <laughs> give me a break. Anyway, listen. I've got a request. Hang on. Let me guess. I also did you add Mina, add because Mina is best girl. <laughs> oh, you know me so well. Uh, you mind, though? But I promise I'll make them come back as paying customers. Oh, good grief. You really an ex-cop? <sighs> You win this time. <laughs> Thanks, man. All right, let's get to drinking. The karaoke bar survive has become a new hangout spot for Kasuga and his party. Okay, um... Yeah, I'm just gonna, like, back out and, like, take it back. There's, It's impossible to say best girl in My Hero. Uh, no, that one's been there for a while. Um, last year, at the beginning of the pandemic, which is like a year from Jesus Christ, I drew my character Alice in a mask. And one of my friends liked the picture so much that they drew an emote version of it. And I was like, you know what, well, okay, let's, let's put it on. Hey, to get started and he passes out? Said he was tired, right? He's probably just tired. Can't blame him after everything we did today. Tomorrow's only gonna be worse. But you know, for some reason, being around you makes it feel like it'll work itself out. Oh, yeah? You must be pretty wasted if you're handing out compliments. Yeah, I was watching, well, um... I was watching an art stream this morning before I went to bed. A buzz. That's a sentence. Oh, he's drunk, all right. Drunk on the rush of a hot and steamy friendship. <laughs> God damn it, Cassandra you, Morris! John. That was two feet over the line, and you know it. Don't poke at um, old But yeah, bear. Twitch was uh, stopping and starting for me earlier. Koeno Disco Queen. Okay. I feel like that's a fucking one-way track to content idville. Aha! Oh. Okay. Just a bed. Not if you get the persona. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so this is just like the uh, homeless shelter. Or the homeless town, or whatever. Ah! Ah! Camera! This is a Sega game. Small corridors fuck up Sonic, too. Hmm? Hmm. 
Listen. Don't be a narc. Dining and fighting alongside your companions will fill your bond gauge with them. Once it's full enough, talk to said companion and survive to trigger their special side stories called Drink Length. God, son of a... This game makes me want to slap it so often. Uh, listening to your companions' troubles and lending them a helping hand can greatly strengthen your bond with them as your relationship grows. Well, the one so does the number of jobs and skills available for your companions. These in turn will improve their abilities. Okay. Yo, Adachi-san. What's that you're drinking? <laughs> hey, keep it down, will ya? Why? Oh. Is that convenience store sake? Shh, you don't have to announce it to everyone and their mother. You brought your own drink to a bar? Hell yeah. It cost an arm and a leg to get a good buzz going here. That's why I got this little lovely at a store down the street. <laughs> you ought to do the same. Show your wallet some tender love and care. Nah, I just order a drink from the bar, even if it meant going into debt. You'd go into debt just for a drink? Hey, it's not just a drink. It's an experience. It's a chance to indulge and just let it all out, you know? Hell, you never know when a drink might change your life. It might lead you to your soulmate. And I say, the guy behind the bar who's helping provide the space for that, that guy deserves some fat stacks. Well, you sure are a nice guy, Kasuga. Well, maybe I should take your advice. Actually, no. If I go into debt, I won't pass my background check. <laughs> hey, here's a solution. I'll buy you a drink. Hey, thanks. Nice guy, Kasuga is the only way. Speaking of money, what they did to you was fucked up, man. Discharge right before your retirement? Ah, it ain't so bad. At least I get to know I was canned for sticking it to fucking Horonouchi. My opinion? That's better than just staying on the force and turning a blind eye. Well, let me see if I remember this correctly. You and Horinouchi first crossed paths during a case 20 years ago. Yeah, and it was a nasty one. Robbery, a double homicide of some sweet old couple. My team found a suspect and made an arrest. A man by the name of Kasumi. He had a mile-long rap sheet, burglaries and shit. Plus, he had no alibi for the time of the murder. But in the end, he was innocent. Yeah. I finally figured that out from his son. His son? Kasumi had a wife and kid. The kid was five years old at the time. His name was Takashi. The little guy told us he'd been on a walk with his dad at the time the homicides were committed. Of course, there's always a chance that the relatives will lie in the hope of saving their family. So HQ was prepared to ignore Takashi's testimony. And I was too at first. But the more time that passed, my thoughts kept coming back around to what the little boy said. And even after Kusumi was arrested, I kept looking into it. I finally found the owner of a cigarette shop. Told me he saw Kasumi walking with Takashi at the time of the crime. Takashi's testimony was legit all along. I contacted HQ right away and requested Kasumi's release. That's not how it works. Or Nouchi made sure it never happened. And he was able to do that because he was top dog at the Kanagawa police back then, right? Yeah. And don't forget, he'd just been offered a job with the Tokyo police, so... He was desperate to cover up any recent blunders like a wrongful arrest. He shipped poor Kasumi off to prison knowing full well the man was innocent. Next thing I know, Kasumi's killed himself in his cell. So Horinouchi was willing to sacrifice people's lives just to advance his own career. Sounds like a cop. I'm starting to understand why you got so much beef with him. Uh, I got beef with myself, too. I'm partly responsible for what happened. If only I'd believed Takashi's testimony from the start, the arrest wouldn't have happened in the first place. You don't know that for sure. No one else believed the testimony either. Yeah, but I'm the one who interviewed the kid. 
Let me tell you, even after all this time, I still can't forget his face. Man. But couldn't you have just leaked the fact that charges were false? You know, to the news? I gotta assume that'd be your way of atoning for Takashi-kun, right? <laughs> well, you're not as dumb as you look, Kasuga. That's exactly what I thought at the time. But I screwed it up. Didn't choose the right people to leak to, so... I got swept off to the license center faster than the leak got swept under the rug. Worst fuck-up of my life. Don't be so hard on yourself, Adachi-san. Sorry. Really killed the mood, didn't I? <laughs> it's okay. A true friend doesn't care how many moods you kill. <laughs> you know, for an ex-Yakuza, you can say some cheesy shit. But it's sweet. What do you mean by that? Yakuza's all about brotherhood. Well, all I know is if I'd had a brother like you on the force with me, my life might have turned out different. Ah, but if the cops were anything like me, this whole country would be fucked sideways by now. <laughs> <laughs> Can't argue with that. <laughs> you weren't supposed to agree with that. <laughs> I anyway, love Ichi. He's so good. Drink on you, if you don't mind. Fine. Hey, bartender, can we get another round? <laughs> Oh shit, level up on the, the on the drink link. Well, it's about that time, I guess. Aw, leaving already? Oh, sorry, Iroha-chan. We got a big day tomorrow. Yo, Namba. You gonna crash on the bar or you wanna head back? <laughs> I like the vibe of this place, though. Me coming back is another thing you can count on. Sure. Make yourself at home. <laughs> Nobody else does. And listen. Take care of him. Sorry? Let's just say he's not usually a happy drunk. Oh, dear. <laughs> I guess that means he has a soft spot for you guys. Oh. Really? Oh, yeah, I know the guy. He's a good for nothing, but he's good at heart, too. So keep your friends close, you hear? I can do that. Hey, Kasuga! What's the holdup? Let's go! <laughs> oh, sorry! Well, see you later. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. So now that that scene is over, and it's probably going to lead into a, another scene directly, how is everybody today? I, I know I asked earlier, but... Guy and Matt weren't here prior, so. Not bad. That's good. Not bad is like... I would have taken not bad all of last week. Yeah, I've got a headache too. Dining at certain restaurants around Yokohama with your friends and ordering certain combinations of menu items will allow you to see what's called table talk. Okay. Okay. Watching Sips today and someone donated 7300 to him. I'm always so conflicted on stuff like that. Because that's awesome. Like, that's huge support to somebody that... Enjoy, from in somebody who enjoys his work, but also I'm poor and people having money makes me salty. Steve, please stop playing Minecraft. Ha! <laughs> Isn't this the day where him and Ryan play, uh, Dad Carball? Laundry details. No. Laundry details. I saw that. Sorry, lady. Hey, you guys want to hear a scary story? Where'd that come from? Sure, whatever. I was at a laundromat a little while back, 
And as anyone would, I put oh, my God, clothes sir, in the dryer. Sir. When there was about five or so minutes left, my cell rang and I went outside to talk. And? After ten minutes, I hung up and went back inside. And then the laundry was gone. The dryer was still going. And the time left? Thirty minutes. Whoa, that is freaky. Did you extend the time or something? Of course not. Why would I do that? Yeah, no good dryer shrank my favorite shirt because of that. The thing got all tight. Still wore it, though. You <laughs> still wore it? Didn't think this story could get scarier, but... <laughs> This game is super charming. Dude, I know Ryan is actually not terrible at Surgeon Sim. At least last time he played. But the idea of Dan playing Surgeon Sim just... Kind of makes me sad. You don't trust Dan? Yeah. That's fair. That's... That's definitely fair. So itchy. Oh. What are you? A piece of glass. How helpful. This isn't a restaurant as much as it is a shop. In game terms, I understand. That's a dumb sentence to say. Jesus! Good job, Ichi. Is there anything in the pocket cafe, like a safe? Like a door that won't open. Rude. What about a washroom? How dare you! Um, order the recommendation. Ring the recommendation will fully recover HP and MP by ordering certain combinations of dishes and the menu. You can create combo meals, so we'll give you bonus advantages. Um, no, um... Okay, Mocha. No. Earl Grey. Scone. Parfait? Yeah, I like this idea. Who's hungry? Wait, did I get a combo meal? Guess not. Oh, shit! Your defense was slightly boosted. Mm. <laughs> Stop punching the air, dude. Was well, that something shiny I saw? Guess not. Stop punching the air! You're annoying me. But yeah, guy, what anime are you on now? I, I know you're fucking zooming through a bunch of them.
It's all right, you got in the way. That was your fault. <laughs> Damn right you didn't run me over, you little shit. Um, I'm a total, I'm a total sucker for, uh, for Shonen. Like, I kind of hate how much I don't hate Shonen tropes. Why is there a bento in the lunch or in the smoke zone? Although, um, I do watch a lot of, uh, random comedy stuff too. But I'm. I'm a little bit less forgiving of just random comedy stuff. Because, like, kind of disinteresting. Shonen can at least kind of be like interesting background sound, but like comedy that doesn't hit the mark is a little bit less forgiving. Waggling mysteriously. Oh no. Shittiest rom com. I do like rom-coms, I won't lie. Four! Dude, I can't wait for the isekai where somebody gets reincarnated as literal trash. You know there's a shot. I do love slapstick. Is this horrible fucking place hiding loot? Because if it's not, it's even worse than I thought. How dare. Actually, this looks promising. Yep. Should I open it? Isekai where they're reincarnated and there's nothing special about them, but they think they are, and they succeed channeling pure Jar Jar Binks energy, and not because they're powerful. So, Konosuba. Sweet! Ooh! Glad I looked. Um, one that I love that a lot of people, like, give me shit for because they never believe it. Um, I really like the first season of To Love Rue. Um, I just think there's something really funny about that series. And then it goes straight up etchy and it's, like, boring. But, I mean, hey, what do you want? Plus, okay, that goes down. And that goes up, okay. I got some accessories now. Um, Because of the Rue part. <laughs> no 
a Russian anime. Oh no. That'd be fucking something though, wouldn't it? Okay, we went basically around the full place now. Except for this little parking area, but I doubt there's gonna be another set. Why are there's Fuck! You did that just to spite me, video game. Should I open it? Got it. Ooh, soft hat. Should I open it? Sweet! Ooh, safety shoes. But yeah, I like To Love Rue, um, the first season, and then it just devolves. I know a lot of people like the... the blatant edginess, but it's one of those things that I'm just like, eh... This isn't my favorite thing. Although I will say, there are some interesting ways that they get to the edgy. I don't dislike edgy stuff. I'm just, like... Like, season one had a lot of, like, funny jokes in it that had a little bit of edgy, but mostly it was just, like, good timing and good slapstick. And then... Season 2 was like, well, I mean, this is easier. Like, I'm, I'm just bitching about something that I don't think literally anybody would care about. Um, okay. There's a lot of people just, like... looking for me to beat me up. Which I don't particularly like. Lower rated anime on your list? There's a weird, weird, etchy anime. I mean, many of them are. Let's be honest. thought it was a BDSM anti at some point. I mean, you're doing a good job selling it, not gonna lie. <laughs> this isn't break time. On to the next bathroom. You're even slower than yesterday. Ah, prison school. Yeah. I've heard about that, but I've never really looked into it. I'm not super fond of the art. And... I'm going! I'm sorry. Are you okay? Hey, watch where you're going, janitor! That guy is blind. <clears throat> is there a plot to prison school? Hello, Director. The woman's father. His name's Tatsuro Mokoda, correct? Understood. I'll carry it out immediately. Yes. Don't worry. Yes. He's out like a light. General anesthesia. Jesus Christ, this is dark. You know, 
Most people hope and pray that they'll die in their sleep. You're one of the lucky ones who actually gets to do it. Stop! Who are you? How did you get in here? Koda. This is Nanoha's dad for sure. No, keep punching him. Sir, wake up. Let's get you out of here. Oh, this music is a banger. Damn. I didn't waste any time. What are you doing here? Contractors aren't allowed. Explain yourselves now. And calm down. Can't you recognize your own uniform? Nice try. Give me a break. You're not one of us. No, we aren't. Because you're not nursing home guards. Not with that kind of weaponry. I bet you got a lot of ink underneath those uniforms. Since you're from the Seiryu clan. Hmm. Huh. So, you did your homework. We know everything, man. Even what the Seiryu clan has been doing in this room. Well, good. That makes our decision easy. We'll have to kill you and the patient! This music is good. Okay. Pigeons. Not in this game. Let's grab her dad and get the hell out of here. Hey, what was that drug you were about to inject him with? It was potassium chloride. Holy fucking shit. Do you know what it does? They use it overseas for executions. The doctor was trying to kill her dad? Now that must have been how they killed the old woman. We got to him just in time. Guys, we ain't out of the woods yet. That's the guy from the cafe. Who is he? We're about to have our chance to ask him. He's coming this way. You all just made the biggest mistake of your lives. I hope you know that. Who are you? The director of this facility. And don't play dumb. I know what else you know. You mean how you're with the Seiryu clan? Yes. I'm Totsuka, from the Ryuto family. The Seiryu clan held its own against the Omi takeover. That made me think you guys must be pretty hardcore. And yet here you are, murdering old people for money. Where's the Yakuza's honor in you? The Seiryu clan is doing what must be done. For the good of society. Oh, fuck you, I have buddy. No idea what burden we've taken on. Killing our elders for society's good? Go fuck yourself! You better let all the residents here go free right now! 
Or I'll tell the whole world what you're really doing here! You're welcome to try. But that would require you to walk out of here alive. And killing you is no inconvenience to me. I've got enough chemicals to melt down all your bodies! Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck! Okay. I got this right. Get caught. Have fun with this. No, he's weak to fire. That's good to know. I wonder if he's also weak to a bat breaker. Yep. <laughs> Fuck, dude. You missed. Watch this. Get serious. Come on now. I'm up. Four. So yeah, Batbreaker, um... Deleted that man from existence. The heroes. Don't make me say it again. Let all the residents go. I'm afraid I just can't do that. Star Fox. Then we'll do it. We'll move them all out. <laughs> you stupid Shit. fuckers. It won't open. I activated the emergency lockdown. That door won't open until this time tomorrow. What? You've lost. So stop fighting me. And maybe, just maybe, I won't call the police. I won't explain to them how our home for nice, well-to-do elderly people is being robbed by three thugs. What kind of Yakuza calls the cops? You're a stain on your family. Call me what you want, but if I call the cops, you're done. I suggest you give up and get out. Maybe instead, I'll rat you out. Oh yeah? Uh, Ichiban? Rat him out to who? The Seiryu chairman. We just need to pay him a visit at their HQ. We'll go tomorrow, bright and early, and get the chairman to fix all of this. Don't you fucking dare! This is my business, not the chairman's! If you breathe a word, I'll kill you! So you're that scared of the chairman, huh? So? So, you're coming with me, you spineless worm. Huh? Yeah, you're gonna take me there yourself. Because if you refuse to come along, I'm gonna tell the big scary chairman everything you did. And maybe some things you didn't, too. I mean, look at yourself. 
doing business like this in the name of the Seiryu clan? As a Yakuza, you accept consequences for your actions. Ichiban is the best. So, does this mean we have to go? Like, I, I, I would really very much like to murder this guy, though. He deserves it. <laughs> But yeah, I, I've the only thing I know about prison school is that it's one of those shows that give like it's one of those things that give BDSM a bad name. Like it's all just violence towards people with like nothing else, which is not the best look, especially since it came around the time that. Fifty wow. Shades picking up speed. But I just don't like the art and I just don't have any interest in looking at it. Listen. Got it. Alright, so we're getting a little bit of, uh, little bit of free time for this, which, I mean, we're already at full health. You open during the day? Cool. Yeah, like, shows like k -On are much more, like, going towards a style than they are. I didn't even notice that was for him. Um, like, they have a definitive art style that they're rocking as opposed to just, like, trying to be as clean as possible. Do I have 12 grand? I do. There you go, Nanda. No longer are you the weak link. Huh. Didn't realize, um, really low res kipau were found in, uh, sex shops. Oh, I don't like this. That felt really weird. <laughs> I need to watch K-On. I just, um... I watched the first few episodes back in the day, but I was, like, using YouTube, so... I couldn't find the rest of the episodes. I don't want to go that way. I actually do want to start the mission after I save, so... Not too fond of using that MP either, but... 
made the battle a lot easier. Hey. Okay. Come on, Totska, you fuck. see any guards that's because no one is stupid enough to try and raid the serial clan <laughs> you set us up we never grant entry to anyone from other factions that gate drops like a cattle chute if someone walks through without giving the correct signal then we take our time with the slaughter. Didn't you learn like the last herbs, time? We don't give a shit. Where's the chairman? I literally the one shot you. Perhaps we'll never reach him. I won't let you get anywhere near his office. Oh, I was really hoping you'd seen the light. As we're back to using brute force, boys. I tell you, never a dull day with Ichiban. People better put us in their wills for this. Bring it! Yo, another banger! Not a loser. Okay. Okay. Um. I got this. Take your fun with this. Okay, so he's not here. He's not fighting. So. Come on now. Let's go. Let's go. You're weak. All right. Take your best shot. Well done. Get alive. Yeah. This. Fuck, I chose the wrong guy. Oh, still worked. You wanna fight? Take your best shot. Alright, boy. You're weak. Check this out. Don't get I missed the timing, but still bopped him. You're up next, so let's do this. I think they're just resistant to bat. Dude, this soundtrack is so good. I generally feel like at this point you know which kind of characters I like. So. You wait right there. You won't be leaving here alive. You gotta be kidding me. How are we supposed to get through? Well, standing around won't solve anything. Let's find another way around. Oh shit, that does open. Or maybe? This music is so fucking good! What are you? An odd stone. 
I'll probably use it to evolve Nonba at one point. Oh, we found it. Hmm? Oh, that's a lot of Yakuza. Including a big boy. <laughs> what? Damn, the other door's locked. This is a dead end. This should hold it. Good call. That looks like a plastic broom. <laughs> Then we need to improvise. Son of a... What the fuck? Where are they? I don't know where they went. The door's locked. And unlock the damn thing before they get away. <laughs> God damn it. Hey, get your ass over here. Oh. Okay. Played with my expectations a bit, game. Yeah, I guess so. Hey. You're good, Namba. Coast is clear. Listen. Those are big bottles. Mysterious mushroom, alrighty. Impure lead, alrighty. Is that a safe? No, it's not. I can't go that way. <laughs> I've been waiting for you. Gentlemen, get rid of them. What a voice. Is it Kratos? Be interrupted. You're weak. Huh? Get alive. Come on in there. Ah, missed time. Let's go. Coits the Monday, is it? I'm up. You fucker. He looked so content. Um, Batbreaker is the big guy here. Okay, yeah, he is. Fuck. Let's go. You're weak. Not quite deleted, but Let's go. Now it was deleted. Take your shot. I'm fucking pissed. Now I'm pissed. What are going? We. Feeling better. Okay. Let's go. 
I choose to believe he died from that. He cannot change my mind. I'll take it. Watch Go, pigeons! This. Have fun with this. I got this. I'm up. There we go. Hell yeah, we're starting to actually make money during these fights. No one else is coming? Pretty weak ambush if you ask me. I bet those idiots wanted to hog the credit for taking out the intruders. Oh, is that what it is? Wouldn't it be easier for them if they all ganged up on us? Nobody climbs the corporate ladder in a group. Criminals included. Huh. No wonder I've never been promoted. No. Oh. Toughness light? I imagine that's not a... Yeah, it's not a growth item. It's probably a battle item. Yeah, uh, energy drink that it recovers 200 HP. Very nice. That would be fantastic. Should I open it? Um, okay. Uh, yeah. Sweet. Use he. Oh, she had a helmet. <laughs> you don't have a helmet on, do you? No, you have exactly a helmet on. Um... Yeah, that's slightly better. Let's go. This music is so good. I'm not sure. I haven't seen so yet, but it's entirely possible. Mysterious leaf. Alright. Okay, so that's just... okay. Can you get out of the way? Once you unlock the ability to change classes, there's in-battle costumes. Okay, cool. The red suit is fantastic. Fire! Oh, I'm running out of MP for Kasuga. I'll let you sit him with a table. Oh no. Okay, we'll kick the table out of him. Oh fuck, we picked up the chair instead. Okay. Let's go. Hey, it's Abel. You wanna fight? Oh. Ow! He kicked a cardboard box at me! You fiend? Massage the back spot. Hell 
Yeah. Yeah, I imagine um, no contest coming in here to see me beating people up with a gigantic Hitachi. It's probably a bit weird. MP rose by nine. Very good. Your back is killing you. My back kept me out of work most of last year. And my work is fucking playing video games. No, um, auto cut. Can't be weirder than Sujimon. <laughs> You're not wrong. Okay, 8 MP. Are we gonna actually... Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna have, like... That. I'll buy more stuff when we get out. It has been weirder. This is moderately tame. You're not wrong. I feel like I have all the context I need for anything this... No, uh, Draken's right. This is actually pretty tame compared to some of the stuff we've seen. You're not a real door. You, you liar. I do appreciate that the guy kicked a box at me, cardboard box, and it only did one damage. I find that hilarious. Half-eaten bento. Aha. Uh -huh. What do we have in this room? Come on. I'll pound you into the floor myself! Hmm... Not a loser! Totska's underlings. Yeah. Um... Take your best shot. Forgot about pound Me. mates. Who the... Yeah, we don't have... the man baby. Get alive! Yeah? Who do I call? The Ghostbusters, clearly. Come on now. Oh, oh man, okay. Let's go. Um You wanna go? You're in it, have fun with this. <sighs> oh, oh yeah. Freaks. Let's go. Get serious. Little was he expecting a baseball swing. Okay, and his defense is down, and I have MP to use. Not much, admittedly. But... Fuck, I mistimed it. Still did good damage. Oh no, am I gonna get grappled? I got a bad feeling about this. Let's skip making the first move and just see how it goes. Defend, okay. Ooh, there we go. Yeah. Kasuga sobered up. Okay, that's good. Guard. Take your yeah. best shot. Okay. I got Let's this. go. Okay, I mean, I wasn't expecting charging at me with a couch, but... Okay. Oh, fuck! Ah! I didn't realize he was gonna do it again! Please level up. Fuck. <laughs> I need that MP refill.
How's it going, Sable? Well, there's HP up. Um... Pretty good. So good. Do I have like 30 plus 15 MP stuffs? I don't think I have 30, but. So good. Rough, tired as fuck. Chilling with Stardew until you get energy. Yeah, um. I don't know. Oh, I didn't even notice the save. Should I open it? Got it. Work overalls. Yeah, I've been, uh. I wanted to draw today, but I just couldn't before going to sleep, and then I was just like, nah. Okay, so it's, um, better healing, and better, I assume, fire defense? Okay. I'll give that to Nanba, I think. Yeah. Okay, and, uh, what about Adachi? Nope. Nope. Okay, cool. Yeah, there's always later. I actually have to end the stream... I want to say relatively early, but two and a half hours is usually around the time that I tap out anyway, but... I do have to end the stream somewhat early. Alright. Which way are we going? Due to, uh, art-related things. <laughs> Behind us! You're never gonna make it to the chairman! He just F5 non by out the window! Hang on! I'll get you out of this! Hold on, Alba! I got you! Fucking nice trick jumps. You do realize you left Adachi with the big man. Oh fuck! That happened. <sighs> God damn it, of course I used all those heals, and there's the heal station. Every fucking time. In every fucking game. Can't save inside dungeons, so. All right, what do we got here? A very big cone of attack. Let's go. Okay. Watch this. Jesus, that hurts. You know it also hurts. Deletion. Let's go. Let's go. You're in it now. Oh, I forgot how to do that one. I haven't used it. <laughs> My bad. Drake always leaves 30 minutes left in the game for a two-hour stream, and Sovey always uses heals before just a heals station. Yeah, basically. 
Restorative medicine. Okay. I'm going to take a wild guess as to what that does. Sorry, Nanba. You're kind of in the way. Oh, shit. There's loot over there. Half empty drink. I've had enough of you rat bastards scurrying around. Time to get exterminated. More underlings from Totska. Oh god, he has a crossbow. And he has a sword. And I have a Hitachi. Check this out. Oh boy, you are strong. Let's go. Yeah, he hits me with the bolt. Pyro Belch has been doing good work in this area. Yep. This is the grass jam. Let's go. You want to fight? <laughs> no, no. What are you doing? Going in. What the hell? Okay. Timing on that one is very weird. I'm godlike. Did less damage than the fucking bat breaker. Actually. Your sword only did 14 damage? You suck. Oh, he didn't fall. Are you also weak to fire out of curiosity? Yeah, you are. Man, this is the grass gym. Nice. Elevator key, I assume. Oh, iron door. The tanky guys are scary. They don't get immediately destroyed by Batbreaker. Nope. We're going back to heal. They give us a free heal, we gonna use it. And they give us a door and we're gonna miss it. You know, all the classics. Non but get out of the way! Okay, not a real door. Just gonna, just was gonna look. Why was don't use the fucking first? You fucking game. You troll. Let me have a drink first. All right, 
What's in here? Should I A silver it? safe. Sweet. More safety shoes. Yeah, I can, but that's not nearly as fun as just trying the doors, nerd. I should probably give my mage more defense. Also, this Yakuza game has a mage. Hand grenade? Oh, that's the first one of those we've had since the uh, prologue. Hmm? Funny how that's just lying around, huh? Mm -hmm. Hi. Please turn the Kabuto. Mm. Uh oh. Oh, it's literally just a button on top of the Kabuto. Okay. All right. Big, obvious, red button. Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> I love when the uh, characters of a video game are annoyed at something happening in a video game. Okay, there's the ladder. There's a ladder down as well. Interesting. Uh, yeah, let's do that. That seems like a good idea. There might be loot. Should I open it? Got My it. hunch was correct. A jacket. All right, what do we have? I doubt it's stronger than military armor. Okay. Um, nope. Oh. Well, you're just gonna get sold then. What kind of fucking loot is that? I'll tell you, not very good. I like the fact that the hero class has given you a red bandana under your shirt. Yeah. And just random black leather gloves. Okay, that's very RPG. Uh, oh, did I get two of them? Uh, rumor to promote healthy blood circulation. It's just plus five attack? Why is that called health ring? Get both health rings. 
cock ring acquired. God, I hope not. What's the biggest Hitachi that exists? God damn it. Matt, you absolute madman. All right, this is where we gotta go. So, are we gonna fight Back somebody? Again, huh? So this is where we are. Oh. Wait, we've we been here already? Doesn't seem too familiar to me. Oh, we were just here a minute ago. You guys have terrible memory. Hey, this place looks safe enough. Why don't we take a breather? I am so happy I didn't use heals. Like, there was no reason to, but I'm sure it could have happened. Why do they sell a back massager with lube? Um... Because they know, they know what's up. They know the real pe the real reason why people buy that stuff now. Um... Isn't there a save in here? No, just another heal. Really? So it glides across your skin. How oh, rude. That is much too large of a fake penis. That looks good. Wait, could I have saved in that safe room? No. Okay, just making sure. Let's go fight a boss, probably. After looking for... yeah. Fucking potted plant! That is a pink carrot. Tiny Hitachi for travel purposes. That doesn't surprise me in the least, and I kind of hate it. Fancy door. Oh. This fancy door leads to nothing but a fancy door. Oh god, I hope that's not used on... on girls. <laughs> oh, goody. Okay, so I know that people in here are pretty weak yeah. to fire. Which means... Grenade? Two of them. I got this. Have fun with this. Let's go. How dare you? Get serious. There's a kid there. There's a kid there. Let's go. Ow! Cool. Take your best shot. Cool you. Weak. Come on, 
Who's this Pokemon? What the fuck? Don't get caught. I got this. this music is fantastic. Are you also weak to fire? That'd be really helpful. You're not. That's unfortunate. Um... He's raged, though. Ah, that's a fuck! Ah, oh, fuck! Fire's weak to him, oh no. as well. Oh, you're not weak to fire. Oh, shit. Well, I mean... Oh, he's just weak to bat. Okay. I'm up. Come on, let's do it. Okay, he's already enraged. Um, are you weak to pigeon? No, but the pigeon's got a crit. Um. Locked it? Nope. Okay. Most ma powerful magic known to them. Yeah, bird is a good magic. Um. I might as well just go for more pyro. Like, if it burns him, that's very good. And it does very good damage on top of it. Okay, so he guards bat, it looks like. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Don't get cocky. Little fucker is just over there waiting by the door. Um Have fun with this. Huh? Watch this. Oh fuck. There we go. Now you're done. Three grand. Fuck yeah. Level up. Job rank up. Level up. Level up. Okay. That's going up. We're all healed too. Moving up in the world. Look at me go. Just Sparta kicks you. How the likes of you learn to fight like that? 
Who are you? Frank West. We're employees from your place of business, Odohime Land. Uh, you're from our own soap land? We were helping Nanoha Mukoda, a woman who works there. We've been sucking money out of her while keeping her dad prisoner in the old folks' home. I told you, we're doing what needs to be done. I've heard all that already, and it's bullshit! Bullshit! You can't just twist the Yakuza code to suit yourself! That's being a fucking prick! Stop this. Ryuhei Hoshino. Boss! Totsuka, what's happening here? Uh, there was a dispute on our turf. And so... You look like hitmen to me. Are you Yakuza? We're not hitmen. We came with a request for the chairman. A request? About Totsuka's business operation. Sunlight Castle? Could we have a bit of your time? How can I be sure you won't try to kill me? Frisk us if you want. We're unarmed. Bullshit! Hmm? Uh, what's wrong? This guy had a strange looking bill on him. <sighs> yeah, I've had that for a while. No idea where it came from, though. Someone just put it in my pocket at some point. <sighs> what should we do? Nothing. It's just play money. You sure you don't want to tie a string around it? Hurts like a bitch if you don't. I suppose you would know, wouldn't you? Of course, after you made me lose two of them. Give me the knife already, Captain. It's natural that society wants to avoid seeing its own underbelly. But luckily for those who refuse to look, I've taken many risks to protect them from the Comey Jewel. I've protected them from the Chinese faction as well. Yeah, I don't know everything about it, but I figured it was the Seiryu clan keeping it all balanced. The balance is starting to crumble. It must be said that in any faction, the men operate businesses unknown to the boss. But I'm hearing that some have gone so low as to extort money from the homeless. Yeah, that's the Yokohama Leomam. I got plenty of personal experience with that. I see. And as for Totsuka, I never thought he would keep such a large business secret. Thank you for telling me. I knew of its existence, of course. And I was glad Totsuka was the director. Our clan bought that building 30 years ago. It was crumbling. Some wanted it demolished. Others wanted to make it a historic landmark. I settled the issue. I said it should be turned into a retirement home, run by Totsuka. I trusted him completely. I never knew he was running another type of business on the top floor. It was still in the exploratory phase. I... I was gonna tell you about it once it became a viable business. It's gross that you're even calling it a business. Don't lie to your boss. Chairman, the whole operation is just wrong. You gotta do something. The people there need to be let out. Hmm. Kasuga, was it? Yes, sir. I think you have the wrong idea here. Sorry? I appreciate you telling me about Totsuka's secret business. But I have no need or desire for your opinion. What? He's murdering innocent people. Misfortune is often a side effect of profit. One's happiness might be purchased with another's unhappiness. To a certain extent, that is unavoidable in our line of work. 
<laughs> Agreed, boss. With that logic, you could justify anything, no matter how dishonorable. Totsuka, I'd like to hear your own description of what happens on the top floor. The excellent course offers a smooth and painless transition out of this life. It's compassionate euthanasia. Euthanasia? That's bullshit! I saw it happen! You murdered the woman who was in a wheelchair! Euthanasia is a painless release given to those who need it. That woman in the wheelchair left this world peacefully. You should realize, sometimes it's not the patient who wants it, but the family. Oh yeah? What about Nanoha's dad? Perfect example. She wanted us to dispatch her father. Liar! What do you know about it? I met with her myself and she approved it! That can't be true. <laughs> Consider this your lesson about certain realities in this world. Anyway, I'm done playing teacher. Totska! <laughs> Sir! Put it down. I don't need your finger. <laughs> Thank you, Chairman. But that doesn't mean that I approve of this little side business you were running. Therefore... Takabe! Understood. Boys, take him out of here. <laughs> what? Show him what'll happen if he ever sets foot in here again. Oh. No. Chairman! Chairman! Kasuga. A Yakuza cannot be judged merely by society's standards of what is right and wrong. Our reputation is everything. But we cannot preserve our reputation if we allow civilians like you to trespass. Don't fool yourself into thinking you did something brave today. The truth is, your actions have disgraced me and the Seiryu clan. I want that knowledge to weigh heavy on your heart. As scared as I should be right now, I'm super into it, Chairman. That was awesome. I'm sorry. I was starting to think that during the 18 years I spent in prison, the type of Yakuza I admired went extinct. But you're one of them. You're the old-school kind of Yakuza. The kind I've always believed in, and always will. I see. I'm glad such a thing is still appreciated. I must admit, I find myself wondering what kind of Yakuza raised you like that. You're asking about my patriarch? Hmm. He was the type of guy who would show up to rescue a dumbass kid who dropped his name just to get out of trouble. Even a kid he never met. He cut off his own finger for the family name. Right. Let's go home. Wait. I'm curious. What was the name of this patriarch? Masumi Arakawa, of the Arakawa family. Ex-Tojo clan. Arakawa? Yep. Although, when I went to find him the other day, he did put a bullet in me. <laughs> so, I guess I should probably take the hint. But he can't take away all the lessons I learned from him. 
To me, he's still the way a man ought to be. Arakawa. I'll remember that. Why is Kasuga the best fucking pro tag? I gotta. Well, oh. guess we should head back to the soapland. Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. Whatever. So, that was a shocker. Yeah, the voice Not work is incredible. The euthanasia. I guess you never know for sure what people really want. <sighs> hey, just a minute, please. Need something, Captain? Come to Sunlight Castle with. I'm having Nanoha meet us there. What? Why? Just do it. Yeah, so like I was gonna say, like whoever at Sega did the casting for the English dub of this fucking all of the credit because this cast is incredible. Are you Nanohamu Koda? Yes. We talked on the phone. I'm Takabe, the general manager. Yeah, me too. Um, where's Totsuka san? He had some urgent business and couldn't be here. <laughs> so I'm filling in. I see. I apologize for how sudden this is, but we're closing our institution. You're closing? Yes. As such, we won't be able to continue caring for your father. We're terribly sorry, but you'll have to make other arrangements for him. But the... the operation, wasn't that scheduled for today? It's been cancelled. We deeply apologize and ask for your understanding. Cancelled? But if he doesn't get that operation, he'll die! Huh? Hold up. What did you just say? They said... He'll die without the surgery. Uh, just double-checking. But is that what you paid Totska for last time you met? What did you two talk about? Um... At the meeting, we... I'm still pretty sure Adachi did pick up his fucking phone from the potted plant. Somehow I scraped together two million yen. But can I finish paying later? Maybe we don't even have to do the surgery that soon. I'm worried he's still too weak for it. Don't tell me you're having second thoughts now. Your father deserves to be at peace. You said it yourself. Now you're cheaping out on him? No, please don't say that. Of course I want Dad to have peace in his golden years. I don't want him in pain, but... Does it have to be so expensive? I'm afraid it does. Given the delicate nature of the task, there may be complications. Don't you see the need for finesse? That's what you're paying us for. Oh, okay. It's just my father's never had an operation. Oh. <laughs> First timer, huh? Hey, if we can laugh about it, it must not be that bad, right? Huh? Uh, I guess.
So she had no idea. It seems not. She thought the operation was a life-saving procedure. Damn, and we barely got to him in time. Nanohasa, let me assure you, the operation is no longer necessary. Sorry? Your father was examined again, and doctors concluded the previous diagnosis was incorrect. <gasps> oh, really? Yes, therefore we are returning this payment to you immediately. We realize how inconvenient our closure is to you. So, all money paid towards care after today's date will be refunded. But... what do I do now? When does he have to move out? Please, don't worry. There will be no forced relocations. As I said, we realize how inconvenient this is for you. Your father may stay here free of charge until you make other arrangements. Are you serious? Finally, some actual fairness. This was by order of the chairman. I'm glad to hear that. Real glad. So, who was it who said she was in trouble again? Leave it alone. Everybody makes mistakes. <laughs> so much for detectives' hunches. Hey, Adachi's mistake led to her dad's survival, so there. Let's just be grateful for our luck. I'll trust you all to iron out whatever you need to. Yeah, we're good. Hmm. Hey, bit of advice. You should put that away. Oh, yes, of course. Now that you've got a fat wad of cash, maybe you can afford to work at a nicer place, you know? Sorry? We were hired to work at Otohime Land while you were out. You were only working there so you could fund your dad's care, right? Uh. Yes. You don't even have to go back. We'll tell the boss you quit if you like. Oh, and we'll get you any back pay you're owed. Really? Oh, that'd be great, actually. No worries. Go on and see your dad. I'm sure he's gonna flip when he sees you. Thank you. Why is Ichiban the you best know, protag? Seeing that smile, I can see why she was their most popular girl. <laughs> Such a ladies' man, aren't you? Okay, let's go report to the boss. Um. Oh God, I need to find a taxi. Well, I found a taxi. Oh, go fuck yourselves. Stern stranger? Okay. Immediately loses job for losing prized asset. Yeah, probably. That seems very Ichiban. <laughs> 